What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another segment of Off the Bench. We are back here at Locust Trace Agri Science Center, right here in Lexington, Kentucky. And I'm sitting here with Julian Palameke Lopez here at Locust Trace High School. You also go to the STEAM Academy, you said, right? Yep. So going into track and cross country, obviously, you know, both involve running. One of them is more of a distance run. The other one is more see how fast you can get there, beat the other comp just beat the other competitors. Is there a distinct difference when you're out there mentally? Like you got to tell yourself, like, okay, I'm, I'm at a cross country meet, not a track meet. So like, and cross country, like we went in hills and everything like that, mm -hmm. like through forest and track, we went like through like normal soccer fields. Yeah. So it's different, like the environments, like running up the hills and going down the hills for mm -hmm. cross country, and for track, it's just a flat surface. And then track, do you just straight run, or do you throw, uh, do you throw shot? Do you do anything like high jump, or anything like that? I only do the straight runs, team relays, and then I do the distance ones as well. So when you're in cross country, like the the mind pace, so you know, you got to pace yourself throughout all these trails and mountains and different things like that. Does that ever come into play when you feel like that sometimes you're getting too far out ahead of yourself, or? You know, you feel like you're not catching up. Like, what's the process of going through there? Be like, hey, do I got to keep my pace? Do I got to up my pace? You know, what, what goes through that? Like, what goes through my mind when running cross country, like, I tire myself out. Yeah. yeah like, it's hard to run, like, when you're, like, like almost, like, two miles. Or you're, like, tire yourself out. You got to tell yourself to keep going. Like, you don't want to walk because that's just going to, like, you feel like you're just giving up. Out here at Locust Trace and at the STEM Academy, you know, right here on a beautiful looking farm, you know, obviously dealing with agriculture and different things like that with animals. What got you into uh, this kind of this kind of program and what got you interested in agriculture in general? Um, what got me interested is in plants like floral design and like fish. Like when you do the cross country, like you can see the forest and then like the beautiful plants and stuff and mm -hmm. even like the lakes yeah. and the ponds, like fishes in there. So my parents were like immigrants and we do work in farms. Mm -hmm. So like picking up tomatoes, corns, and it just got me interested in it. I got you. I can grow plants. And so you're involved in a lot of con uh, contests uh, through Locust Trace here through the Kentucky Farm Bureau. Why don't you tell me a little bit more about that? The Kentucky Farm Bureau, like what we do is a speech conscious. It's like a one minute and like something we have to memorize it. Not, not like always, but we can have a piece of paper with us mm -hmm. and read up like the speech. Yeah. And what was my speech about was like about instinct um, fish, the vaquita. Mm -hmm. And it like, I was talking about how it's going to stink and like only have a few left like this year. Going forward, you know, what do you what are you looking to get out of your experience here at Locust Trace with agriculture, and what do you want to do moving forward with that? What I'm planning to do is like owning my own restaurant, like being a chef, and like I want to grow my own vegetables and not like buy from stores and like grow my own fish, produce my own fish. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is a dream that I have. That's awesome, man. Well, everything you've got here, you got at the right, at your fingertips to make that dream come true. I wish you nothing but the best of luck, my man. And hopefully one day I can come in and enjoy a nice meal at your restaurant, man. Looking forward to that. Yep, thank you. I appreciate you. you, man. Thank you. This has been another great segment right here at Locust Trace High School. This has been Off the Bench every Thursday right here on WKYT Everyday Kentucky. We'll see you guys next week. Off the Bench with Cash Daniel brought to you by UK Federal Credit Union.